The Robot Safety Center, located in Tsukuba, Ibaraki, was established in October 2010. Service robots are expected to come into wide use in practical applications such as nursing, welfare, household support and security. However, techniques and standards for human safety have not yet been established. We believe that implementing a new system to certify the safety of service robots will lead to their practical application and commercialization. To prove the safety of service robots, they require safety certification from testing authorities. The Robot Safety Centre will provide the facilities to develop testing technologies for verifying safety. We will also be the central base for the new examination and certification systems used by testing authorities and contribute to important international safety standards. The Robot Safety Centre has been established as the base for the NEDO project for practical applications of service robots. Tests on ordinary industrial products such as mechanical tests, electromagnetic compatibility tests, collision tests and functional safety tests in which the robots stop or avoid obstacles before a collision occurs are performed at the centre. This centre consists of the operation test area, inhabited environment test area, electromagnetic compatibility or EMC test area and strength test area. In the operation test area, we perform safety tests on the robot movement as well as halt and collision avoidance tests. This area provides measuring devices that record the results of tests in an optimum space and environment for the operation of robots. In this demonstration, a service robot avoids an obstacle. Using a special camera, it is possible to detect the position of the robot down to the millimeter. In the inhabited environment test area, crash tests and tipping over tests are conducted to measure possible human injury by service robots that work around people. This is a demonstration of a crash test. The data gathering methods and experimental conditions are totally different from motor vehicle tests because their speeds are different. Just like general industrial products, robots must go through mechanical strength tests to prove their safety. In the strength test area, we conduct durability tests, impact tests, load tests, environmental resistance tests, vibration tests, and so on. This is a demonstration of a durability test for a wearable robotic suit. Until now, the durability test had been performed manually. Using environment vibration combined test equipment, the environmental resistance of robots is measured. Tests can be performed with vibrations and at various temperatures and levels of humidity. In the EMC test area and anechoic chamber, we measure operational changes in the service robots when they are exposed to strong electromagnetic waves and electromagnetic noise from robots while they are operating. This material absorbs electromagnetic waves. To block waves from external sources, the material is installed all over the walls in the anechoic chamber. Including those shown here, a total of 18 safety testing devices are installed in the centre. The Robot Safety Centre will conduct research and development into safety standards and safety verification techniques for robots. We expect that various kinds of service robots will go out into the world in the near future through our centre.